Yo, what is good, yo? It's your boy Ty back here with another video. In this video today, we are going to be playing one hour of Triple Threat Online for the new Pink Diamond Larry Nance. So in this hour, I'm going to keep track of how much MT I've made, how many tokens I've made, and ultimately, if I can get this Pink Diamond Larry Nance. So we're gonna put an hour on the clock, and if you are new to the channel and have not yet, please smash that subscribe button as we're on the road to 40,000 subscribers and let's see how much MT tokens and if I can get Pink Diamond Larry Nance. One hour on the clock. We're going out there with the kind of interesting squad because I'm running this squad really because I need to get some challenges done, but I'll switch it up here after Patrick Ewing uh, gets, I think, 21 total points and Carl Malone only needs eight total assists, but that's besides the point. I'm just trying to win these games as quickly as possible. So with that being said, hopefully Steph Curry can do his thing because that's about the only guy I got out here right now. Obviously, Patrick Ewing's okay, but he's not going to be the guy I'm going to be winning games with. And the important thing is that you win games and get quits as quickly as possible. Is there we go. We get a quit in the first game. Pretty big W right there. I obviously missed time my drop right there, but still, I mistimed it. I'll take the 250 MT and move on. Free 250 MT. In my first triple threat game. This guy got the same team. Chill. One more. Carl Malone. You know what he does. Chill. Good shot by Carl Malone. I got to learn how to green. I'm on next gen too. Because I feel like if, if the ball drops are sped up, I mean, next gen is a pretty good way to get quits pretty fast. This guy I played here was not bad. Like, he was pretty solid at the game. But I did make some strides. Carl Malone does have three assists. And Patrick Ewing has some points. Not a ton of points. But at least some points to, to make it look like I, I got something done with him. Steph Curry, I can't green with him today. I don't know what's going on. Come on, Patrick. I need you to I need you to get, get, get something going for me. Come on, Steph. There it is. Finally, I get a green light to end the game with Steph Curry. I'm going to drop it in the middle. Hopefully, I can get this 500 MT here. But even if I don't, it's not that big of a deal. 500 MT plus you hit a couple of the, of the middle things and you're going to be looking nice. Like, go middle. Go middle. Right there, I just got 700 MT on the one ball drop, which you can't really complain about that. Oh, yeah, it is Diamonds and Duncan. I must have missed I must have missed saw it or something. I thought it was an emerald. This guy's got a pretty solid squad as well. All right, whatever. Just get the ball to the old reliable Steph. That's, you got to green that. I don't care. You got to take over. That's green. Good shot. He sold. This guy's selling. I'll just take my dunk. It doesn't matter. Carmelo did get three more assists. I'm gonna check quick uh, and see. I'm pretty sure he got his challenges done. So we're gonna shut. We're gonna sub Carmelo out and put Chandler Parsons in the game because with Chandler Parsons, he needs assists too. Another ball drop in which MT is the only thing that I'm going to get from it, which I don't really care about. I think it is what it is. MT, I'm not going to complain about it. Two more assists with Carl Malone, and then he'll be done with that. But how to check the challenges quick, because I'm, I don't want to do these challenges or play Triple Threat online and not do these challenges. I might as well knock out two with one. I like, guess fine. I'll live with that. Run. Oh, yeah, Steph, do your thing. Hey. Can you roll? Thank you. Thank you. Like, he's a baby in there. He will not be able to defend that anytime. Oh, yeah, Carl. Get that last assist. Carl Malone getting his last assist needed. We're going right to Chandler Parsons afterwards. That's the last assist Carl needed, so I'm glad I got his two assists. We're going right to Chandler Parsons next. I'm, I need to check and see how many assists he needs. But we're moving and grooving so far. I gotta, Is this another one ball drop? How many one ball drops are there? I'm just confused right now. Just give me MT. That's all I really want. Like, you're doing too much at this point. Just give me my 200 MT and let me move on, 2K. What is, what is good? Can I just get MT and move on? I'm just wasting time here. But the ball drops definitely are quicker than they used to be, at least at, at this lower tier. We're matched up against the same guy, and hey, I'll take that. If I can keep matching up for that guy every single game... I'll take it because it's just a quick win and I'm not ever going to complain matching up versus him. So here we could get a flash pack, two tokens or 400 MT. So this is where we'll see the next ball drops. Is it as slow as it has been or is it way quicker? And it looks like it looks like it is quicker than it used to be because it used to be super, super slow and like laggy. Uh, but it's looking pretty quick here. So I'm not going to obviously complain about it. But obviously MT on the wheels is the main thing as well as you can capture a lot of MT with just a 400 MT. As well as that KD pack that I that I really want. I want to get it into the yellow more than anything. I don't really care about the tokens. Uh, but I guess I'll take two tokens. That's fine with me too. As long as I can just get right into my next game. Because the more games I play, the better chance I have of getting Pink Diamond Larry Nance. Oh no, he's going to take leaners all game with Kiki. We know what this is like. 
We know what this is like from my gameplay. He's going to be AIDS with Kiki. Can Patrick go to the cup? Never mind. That's fine. That's fine. Steph, I need one. Hits the white to end the game. Chandler Parsons has his assist. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure the next guy in line for triple threat online assists is Iman Shumper. So he's going to be the next guy I plug into the lineup. Here's another example. I don't care what I get. 100 MT is not is not optimal, but it is what it is. If I happen to get 100 MT, I'm fine with it. I, I'm not going to complain. As long as I'm getting wins towards that top reward, that's really all that it is. Obviously, 100 MT is an awful reward, and you don't you don't want 100 MT or anything like that. This is awful. Let's go. Let's go. It's taking forever to drop. I just want it to drop. There it is. The wheels are the best thing. That's the best thing that you can really get out of this is the wheels. Obviously, tokens help too. But here I'm at 300 MT, 400 MT, 500, 600. 600 MT already just out of the wheel is absolutely ridiculous. 700 MT. So total of 800 MT off that drop. And that's the thing. You get 1,000 MT off of one drop almost. And that's absolutely insane. 200 i love counting the mt that you make off the wheel it's absolutely crazy so pretty sure we made 300 mt off of that drop as well as getting the one token so here i'm gonna go make sure chandler parsons challenges are done and then we'll hop into another triple threat game put iman shumper in here for chandler parsons and then let's hop into this next game uh purchasing five contracts for iman and let's go crazy chill on my man steph my word i missed Look at Patrick Ewing. Do your thing. You got to get 21 points somehow. It's so easy to get wins when you got Steph Curry. Like, that's one guy I'll run no matter what challenges I need to get done. The fact that I'm doing a triple threat online challenge for an hour, I'm obviously going to run the best player in the game in Steph Curry because he gets quit so fastly, fast, especially in on next gen. So, obviously, I made some decent strides with Iman Shumpert and Patrick Ewing, but... They, those players don't matter as long as I'm running Steph. So here I can get a contracts pack, a token, or 200 MT. The big thing, again, is the wheels. If I can hit some wheels, that's where I'm going to make the majority of the MT. 300 MT just off of the wheels alone. And we're not done yet. If it hits the, if it hits this wheel too, you're looking at 500 probably if it hits this wheel here on the left-hand side. So I did get 300 MT and one token off of that ball drop, which, I mean, isn't bad at all. I'll take that every single time. It's just ball drops can take longer than the games itself, which is kind of annoying. I wish that changed a little bit. But I don't mind when it just goes directly into that MT slot. Obviously, I wanted to hit the wheel, though, because the wheel is very, very good, very useful. But I don't have a problem anytime I just get some free MT. Three hundred MT plus the two hundred five hundred total MT. There, our MT is in pretty good position after these games. So I think we're now up to yeah, we're now we should be up to the top board in which I have a chance to get Larry Nance. All right, let's go crazy. Who are we up? I see Bingo Smith. I mean, Bingo is not bad, but he's not Steph Curry. It's just too easy on next gen if you have Steph Curry. This is actually a close game for some hat. Like some way it is. I don't I don't understand it. Like I've been trying to go crazy with Patrick. And it's just, it's it's a close game somehow, whatever, Iman. Just get a, get me a bucket. I got to find a way to win this game because if Larry Nance pops up on the board and I only got one ball for him, I'm going to be very, very upset. So come on. Can you guys get me a stop, please? Like, Cat's got 95 points and I'm getting mad. That's a bucket too. No way. No way I lose to this team right here. There's just no way. Steph, I need a three at this point. I don't, I don't even got a choice. I need a three. Come on. Give me one. You whited and I missed. Where's Steph? Find him. Come on, pal. All right, come on. Can y'all give me a stop, please? Like, I do not want to lose to Bingo Smith. And, like, it's not even a good cat. It's literally Sapphire Carl. Oh, yeah, this box now. Yep. Yup, it's box now. Mm hmm There's no way. Thank you. That's moving after dribbling the whole possession. I was finna say, no way. Come on. Come on, Steph. Chill. Chill. Like, think I won't go crazy with Patrick Ewing for the final point of the game? That was an absolute sweat, and it definitely shouldn't have been. But I'll take the win no matter the situation. All right, can I see Larry? Uh, no, Larry. We do see 1,000 MT in that bottom right corner. 
But here's the best part about it is no matter what, yes, they did definitely speed the ball drops up. At least for me, it's, it's going pretty quickly. But the best thing about this is there's the two wheels with tokens and MT. That's where you're going to make the, the most of your MT or tokens is based on those two wheels. So I definitely like that. I'm fine with getting an extra token there in the bottom left-hand corner. But the big thing is I want to see Larry Nance on my board. That's obviously what I want more than anything. So that's, that's the biggest thing for me. Hopefully I can get it. Let's see. I want to keep hitting this to token wheel too because I'm, I'm in position to honestly get uh or on pace to get my the galaxy opal that drops next uh next season but if we see one or if we see more than one galaxy opal, i want to be prepared for that as well so we'll see where this ball drop leads to but these ball drops definitely be they be taking a while man and go right go right to the thousand mt all right, 250 extra MT. No complaints here. Let's just keep this thing rolling. I always will drop in middle to at least get that free 100 MT at that top wheel. And there you see 450 total MT on that ball drop. Still, if those add up. Those all add up. If you play for an hour, you're going to see the MT really add up over the course of time. Can you, like, go middle. Give me some extra tokens. All right, go right. I need you to go right now. Give me this 1,000 MT. I'm like begging for a thousand MT. I'm down bad. Like I'm really am. I need MT more than anything. That's fine. I'll take 250 MT as long as we can keep moving through this, man. I got Iman Shumpert's challenges done uh, there really quickly. So what do I need with Danos? Two steals. I need assists with Dana. I might as well play him uh, here um, and, and might as well start getting some assists with Dana. I think he's a point guard, right? There he is. Uh, he's awful, but it doesn't matter as long as I got Steph Curry. Steph is literally a cheat code. And he did his thing. Steph, I mean, Steph's doing his thing. Patrick Ewing got his points. So we'll see who I can plug in after that. And we're just plugging guys in and doing challenges. That's really what it is. I can see a thousand MT again. I just want to see my mans. That's who I want to see in this in this triple threat challenge. But I, I don't think it's not looking good so far. I will say I do think it's better to play on next gen as far as grinding triple threat online. I will say that. So that's one thing, you know, that you do have in your favor if you do have next gen is to play on next gen because I feel like you get quits faster as well as it's, you know, easier. It's just more fun and easier to play the game. All right, let's go. I promise you guys, though, the MT is going to add up. You guys are going to see it. It's going to add up like crazy once we get to the final calculations on how much MT I truly made. Because even on this ball drop, even if it goes in the blue, if it goes in the yellow, will be even better. But it, yes, sir, go yellow. Thank you. Finally, I get my 1,000 MT. And that's big time for a guy like me who needs all of the MT possible. I would definitely take that 1,000 bonus. That's fine. Just go in, go in the token slot. That's fine. Three tokens on that ball drop is big time as well. So you do get pretty fire rewards from Triple Threat. I'm not going to lie to you. It's not just about playing for Larry Nance like, like it is for Wayne Embry when you play Triple Triple Threat offline is not near as rewarding, right? Because when you don't get Wayne Embry, usually the vault doesn't open. And when it does, it's nothing crazy. So that's why I do really like Triple Threat online more. It's just because the rewards are definitely way more worth it. All right, let's go. Um, I think I'm going to plug in Hakeem Olajuwon. I'm going to look and make sure. Uh, it's either Hakeem or Carl. Let's see here. Um, so I'm in Triple Threat Online. Hakeem just needs points. And yeah, so I'm going to plug in Hakeem Olajuwon and just score with him when, when the opportunity presents itself. But Dana still needs assists. Now, this will be my last chance to... Oh, he's quitting right away. Perfect. So this will be my last chance to see my, my mans. I need to see... I need to see Larry Nance right here on the board. It is my last opportunity to see him. And oh my word, he's there. Oh my word, we got a chance. So you're saying there's a chance for me to get Larry Nance. Just do not sell, Ty. Just do not sell. I'm dropping it where I always do in the middle. Do not sell. Go left. Oh my lord, I'm already 0 for 1. Where do I drop it here? Like, where do I drop it? I feel like I got to keep dropping it there. But I want Larry Nance. Come on, bless me, 2K. Bless me. Stop giving me the MT, man. It's not what it's, it's not what's supposed to happen. Okay, I, I, I've already messed up twice. Come on, Come on. Uh, do I drop it right? Let's drop it right here. Do not go. Oh my gosh, I'm I'm really selling. Go go right. I'm really selling. Okay, I only got two ball drops left because I can't get past that initial one. Just drop it in the middle. That's that's where I. Chill, chill. Go. Thank you. There's a chance. Oh my gosh. 
I'm getting hoed. I see Larry Nance and I can't get him. I'm getting hoed. Please don't hold me, 2K. Let me get my mans. Last ball draft, last opportunity to get him. Chill left. Thank you. I'm so angry. I'm so mad. The one time I get a chance to get Larry Nance. I don't even get past where I need to get. And oh my word, I had a chance to get Larry Nance. And I failed. All right, here we go. We got another matchup. I'm pretty sure I've already played this guy. I have played Iman. I know I have. So you're just going to let me do what I want to do. That's fine. Just let Steph go crazy. I miss, bro. What a rough start to the game. I can't tell you how glad I am to have Steph Curry because he legitimately, legitimately makes everything so easy for me. Like, I've, I've not struggled in really that many games because whenever I need a bucket... I know who I can count on to go get me one. I'm telling you, if you can split the middle and get something like that in the extra 200 MT, obviously I want the contracts pack with it. And the contract pack, you're not going to see with the, with the total MT and tokens and stuff at the end. But a silver contracts pack is worth at least 1,000 MTs. Right, let's go crazy. Come here. Back to Hakeem. Oh, yeah, okay. Like, are you going to help off a of Danos or what's going on here? What's going on here? You got to help off a... Of oh, my gosh. Why can I not green with Steph? It is going to look like this will probably be the last game because if it's under two minutes and I'm not starting a game because that's just, it's pretty unrealistic, you know, to finish a game in two minutes or whatever. So I probably won't start another game out of this. But Steph Curry is absolutely ridiculous. The fact that Dana is getting some assists with it just because Steph is so great is, it's nice to have a guy like Steph that can just really make plays. Get it to him one more time. Pulling up on the break, I missed. I don't understand. Maybe we will be able to get another one in. We'll see here. But last board for today because we are like really at that two minute mark. Let's see what we can get. Obviously, the contract pack again is what I'm going for. Good. A little extra MT here and there helps. Uh, and that's definitely a, it's a W. Let's see. Can I get a, a little more MT out of y'all? What is this? How much MT is this? 100 MT, that's fine. So out of that ball drop, I still got 300 MT, which I'm not ever going to complain about. So in an hour, you guys might wonder, how much MT did you make and how many tokens did you gain? I gained a total of 15 tokens, and that's not without, I didn't even get any of the top rewards. Like, I don't, that's basically all from the wheel or one token. So I gained 15 tokens and 12,000 MT. So that's pretty good, honestly. If you play a full day of Triple Threat Online, you're going to make some pretty good progress. Not only in MT, but tokens is, is really where you're going to notice it the most. Obviously, Larry Nance is who I wanted. Couldn't quite get him, but I'll probably play a little more Triple Threat Online throughout the course of today to try to claim Pink Diamond Larry Nance. So that is going to wrap it up. Again, Triple Threat Online is a very, very solid two, a way to make MT not only today, but always, especially with Larry Nance on boards. I think, obviously, for me personally, it's a great day to play Triple Threat Online. Guys, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Comment down below. Have you guys seen Larry Nance on boards? Let me know. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. And have a blessed day.